Finders reported 31,443 new coronavirus cases in the last 24 hours. Now, this is good news because these are the lowest numbers that we've seen in 118 days. But there's been a big jump as far as daily deaths are concerned. India's reported over 2,000 deaths in the last 24 hours. This is mainly because a backlog from Madhya Pradesh has in fact been added. Uh, the active caseload in the country uh, so far continues to remain below the 5 lakh mark. 4 lakh 31,000 uh, is the total number of active cases. This is the lowest uh, in 109 days. The daily positivity rate is also below 2% and it's been less than 3% now for 22 consecutive days. Let's go right across to Sukirti to make sense of these numbers. Sukirti, uh, the COVID numbers, you know, are, have been on a decline, but the, there's been a huge jump in deaths in the last 24 hours. Break down the numbers for us. Uh, well, yes, one ray of hope is the fact that the daily numbers have been declining uh, in the last 24 hours, 31,443 cases, which is the lowest in 118 days. Uh, so this is significant because uh, we have seen those crisis days in April and May where we were reporting uh, at least 4 lakh cases per day. So a huge decline from those and there has been a trend of this decline in daily numbers. Uh, so that is something that is uh, could go in India's favour. However, the number of deaths today have suddenly shot up. They've gone beyond 2,000, primarily due to the backlog of, of at least 1,400 deaths that have been added in Madhya Pradesh. So at this point of time, India's positivity rate, daily positivity rate is below 2%. That is a good sign. The daily numbers are low, are on the decline. That's a good sign. But the number of deaths, if states keep on adding backlog of deaths, that is still a worry. These deaths may not have happened in the last 24 hours, but 1400, over 1,400 deaths in Madhya Pradesh is still a significant mark and raises a lot of questions on how states are collating the death data.